I am standing in the Alameda County Sheriff's Department shooting range in Dublin, California, where we are planning to shoot some guns at our newly completed Iron Man armor to find out if it's bulletproof. And if it is, well then it has crossed that divide from costume to real armor. I'm kind of excited to find out. It's like a cooking show, but with guns. For today's test, my team and I constructed a remotely operated gun stand that will allow me to pull the trigger from behind a shield to avoid ricocheting bullet fragments. We'll be firing multiple calibers of bullets to test the armor's resistance to increasing impacts. A 22 caliber, a nine millimeter, and a 45 caliber. Think of them as small, medium, and large. Awesome. I feel like that is in a good position. The impact of a bullet is determined by the projectile's mass and velocity. The bigger the bullet and the faster it travels, the greater the damage done to the target. We're hoping the bullets won't penetrate our titanium armor, but if they do, we want to be able to measure the damage. Cue the dummy. Right here, right there. Perfect. We found this company that makes ballistic gel dummies with bones and organs that have been calibrated to be the correct density of proper organs. And as you can see, this one is slightly used. All right, get the armor. We'll be firing all three of our different caliber bullets from handguns at a distance of 20 feet, close enough to inflict mortal damage to an unprotected human torso. Safety is off. Here we go. Gonna shoot at some Iron Man armor. Oh. All right, buddy. See you on the other side. Here we go. 3D printed titanium Iron Man armor versus 22 caliber bullet in three, two, one. <laughs> oh, there is no break in the surface. There is no dent, no nothing. I can see the mark where the 22 caliber hit. But there is no tactile sign that a bullet hit this, and that means that this is bulletproof. But it's a 22 caliber round. I would like to fire some higher firepower at it to find out just how bulletproof it is. <laughs> I can't believe I just said that sentence. We're moving up to a nine millimeter round. It's not just bigger than a 22 caliber. Because it packs more gunpowder, it travels at a much greater speed. There we go. Right. Here we go. Nine millimeter round versus Iron Man armor in three, two, one. <laughs> 